Hello, Allison here, and in today's FileMaker tutorial, I am going to show you an important and often overlooked part of the database design process, choosing a FileMaker field naming convention. Let's get started. To begin, let's look at when the field names appear. People using the database see field names when sorting, exporting, and on layouts they, that they use that are in table view. A FileMaker developer also sees field names in the field section of the Manage Database and in layout mode when designing layouts. So in FileMaker, we can see the FileMaker fields when we choose sort. The fields are here. When we choose file export uh, records, you'll see it here. And when we are in a layout that is in table view, the headings at the top here are uh, directly pulled from the field name. And as a database developer in Manage Database, you will also see uh, the field names in the uh, fields section of the Manage Database, as well as when we go into Edit Layout, the field names appear uh, here. The natural thing to do when naming is to do things like first name, last name, with a space. The thing is that computers don't like spaces. Think the HTTP URL address, it doesn't have any spaces. To handle the space issue in names, programmers came up with some conventions. So there are three database naming conventions that are commonly used. They are title case, in which the uh, first letter of each word is capitalized, camel case, in which the first uh, word is uh, lowercase and all of the following words are uh, uh, title case with a capital letter, and underscore, in which each of the words is separated with an underscore and the words are each capitalized, or uh, all uh, lowercase, but there's an underscore separating them. FileMaker field naming conventions impact people and computers. People see field names when they do day-to-day -day activities like sorting, exporting, looking at data in a table view, defining fields, or editing in a layout. Computers rely on field names that have no spaces in them so that they can talk to each other well. Places where computers talk to each other are in integrations with one another. They could be SQL databases or they could be uh, services like Salesforce, QuickBooks, or MailChimp. In choosing a naming convention for your FileMaker database, play the odds in your favor. Natural names that include spaces are super for people and perfect for when computer integration is unlikely. No space names are a great choice if computer integration is planned or likely down the road. You may wonder, what if you chose natural names and need to integrate later on down the road? Don't worry, you can create calculated versions of the fields needed for the integration and give these fields names with no spaces. Whatever field naming convention you choose, whether it's camel case, title case, underscore, or natural name, it's important that you be consistent. Being inconsistent with your naming conventions leaves people wondering why the difference. That's confusing, causes mistakes, and slows things down. Being consistent means that people find the database easy to use and follow and understand. That's our tutorial for today. I hope you found it useful. If you did, if you would give it a thumbs up, and if you would like to see more videos like this, please go ahead and click the subscribe button. Thank you very much for watching and have a great day.